This looks terrible. <laughs> Ugh. I'm gonna put the green M&M &M somewhere. I reckon, I, like if I spent more time on this, I could make it more realistic. So I was thinking about art, I want to paint, and then I was also thinking about these shoes that I got today, because I love wearing heels everywhere, and like, to be honest, it makes Australian women really fucking uncomfortable, like to the point where they bring it up in a negative tone. Um, so I was thinking, and then I looked at this, and I was like, ah, I should paint like a leg with a heel on it. Because I find it so interesting that like your outfit, like people find such issue with it that they bring it up. Hectic. Okay, it's not a huge painting, but it's definitely bigger than my other ones. <laughs> this is not a one-handed job. Art. 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 I need orange. Seems legit. Yeah. That should just be an artwork on its own if I were a shit artist. The oil paint is a slightly more yellow shade and I like it. This is perfect. I'm going to get rid of these brush strokes. There it is, you can see it there. I think I waited like a bit too long. So this is the background color now. Um, yep, that's the background color. It's what I wanted anyway. There's just no shading. Shoes. There we go. Okay, there's my shoes. This is how I'm going to take the painting. There we go. That's, that's. This is gonna be almost too easy, but I want it to be like, I want there to be nothing here. Okay, so it went like this kind of. I should be... It's funny, like this is straight legs, but like it doesn't look straight. Okay, I need to look at the picture. This is not looking good. Looking pretty modest. Alright, now I just need to make it look good. Today I'm sharing this artwork with people. It's got a hand. I don't need a skirt on this. The skirt plays no role whatsoever in the artwork. I'll cut off the legs and then that way I keep in my idea of surrealism. I waited too long. I waited too long. Oh, I'm gonna have to paint and blend. It's essentially starting again. This looks terrible. <laughs> um, I think I'll end up just redoing the entire background. So I saw this thing on TikTok about someone making a fuss about um, the green M&M not wearing heels anymore. Why does she not wear heels anymore? Like... I'm gonna put it in my painting. I'm gonna put the green M&M somewhere. Time to try again. Time to try again. This is so dry. I can, I can like, okay, so I can just do the background and then work on these for tonight. How's this one? It's good. Okay, since I'm doing the same color, I think I only really need like a thin amount. Ish. Okay, maybe I need more white. My new set of paints don't arrive for like two, three days. So I have to be careful with using all the white. Not great, you can still see it if you look really hard. I want some depth, just like my last artwork. Um, I don't think I got it right, but I'm hoping to add more lighting later on because the black here turned to grey and like I was expecting that because it was still wet. So when I want a black black and then I'll have some white white and then I'm thinking I'll put some cracks in the walls. And white time. Unrealistic amount of contouring. Because paintings never actually look like photos, like no matter how close you get. Look at this one. Close, but it's never gonna look the same. I like to increase the contrast because it's just gonna look better. Oh, 
maybe I'm not gonna have it so simple anymore. I want things dripping out. Like maybe I could do a pearl necklace dripping out. I don't want items that represent feminism um, because people are already so sexist. He has hesitations. Okay, there's an artist, Kim Lutweiler. Um, I, I don't really like her artworks because like, for me, it associates LGBTQ with aggressiveness because the faces look quite aggressive in her artwork. I'm worried that the shading and the background in this painting is starting to look like Okay, so I'm just editing the video and then I realized that I didn't actually say the Kim thing out loud, that what was going on in my head. But I wanted to put lots of things coming out of the legs. Um, and Kim's artworks, they have lots of like splashes of color, which is the, what the pink remind me of. Flat backgrounds and lots of skin in her artwork. Um, I understand that our artworks look entirely different, but I was like, fuck, I want no resemblance whatsoever. I have to ditch the plain background. I think I need to make it an actual actually something. I think it's something about the colors and the shading that's reminding me of. Oh, that was done terribly. How do I even? Um, I think I'm ready to like level up and put some skirting on my walls. something basic. I've changed my mind again. I think it's good. It's good. It's good simple. I still want to make these look more realistic. I know I sound like a dick. I'm trying to copy that. That has different lighting to this. I think it's starting to reach a point where it's starting to look like real depth, like here, and I'm enjoying it. I'm just gonna make it look good. I haven't even looked at the structure of a body yet, so this could be wrong. This could be wrong. Here is some paint that's the wrong color. That's all right. Yeah. M and M. I reckon, I, like, if I spent more time on this, I could make it more realistic. But to be honest, I'm just gonna wait till I'm more skilled and I can do it faster. Fuck yeah, you stuck around to the end. Um, I, I hope you enjoyed that. And if you want to see more of that particular painting, I've got unlisted time lapses right here. Um, I kind of ran my YouTube channel into the ground only posting time lapses. So if you want to help me revive my channel and support more artworks being shown like this, then just make it background noise. Like, make my videos background noise if you want. But yeah, check it out.